I know our class goes at a very slow pace. This is a freshman level introduction to public speaking, and some of you probably could do it in two weeks, but I appreciate those students that hang in there. I am reading the discussion boards and I am admiring how much you've opened up, how much honesty there is, how many cool ideas and great insights. However, not everyone's participating. Please don't miss that part of this class. We're getting ready to go into our next voice thread for next week. So we've done our in the news and now we're going into informative. Please don't forget it. I know sometimes I get nervous for you thinking, don't let this class slip away. It was meant to be slow paced. So you could have, you know, really mull things over and you could think and you could learn about yourself. You know, in these discussion boards, I've noticed some students, I think even surprised by what they write, you get, I get more honesty and openness from students in an online class that I do in face-to-face. -face. If we have a discussion board for the assignment, and I don't show videos in class, I think that's a waste of time, but that's the assignment to watch the video and we come in and we try to have a discussion, maybe two, three people will speak, you know, and that's it. But in this class, everyone is contributing. So it's rich, it's a rich environment for learning and it's inspiring, it really is for each one of us to no, we have each other's backs and we're there to listen to all opinions and all points of view and all worldviews. It's very important. So the other thing to remind you of is the journal. The journal this week is due on Sunday. Three people have done the journal and we have 13 in that class. So you're probably thinking, oh, is that really an assignment I have to do? Yes. And you pick three students in our class and you're going to report on them a paragraph each. But it's really your, your reflections on their presentations, your appreciation of their work. And to teach, it's like you're teaching, you're, you know, you're writing a little critique, is to learn twice. Because every time I write about another student saying, how is their engagement with the audience? How is their posture? What did they say that I might have really enjoyed? I think about my own speeches. What about me? You know, what about your engagement with the audience? What about your posture? So it's very easy to give a review of someone if it's in isolation, but these aren't in isolation. These are self-reflection pieces, even though the person you're writing about never sees, the, never sees them, they weren't meant to, they're really for you to reflect on the art of oral communication, which you're all doing right now beautifully. So you're gonna transfer the skills that you have already started to develop from your self-introduction into your in the news into your informative. And truly, this class will go by really, really fast, really does, because we're already on our, our second presentation. I'm in a classroom with that, with the motion detector lights and the lights just went off. It's like time to go. I hope you're well. I'm enjoying listening to you. I'm looking forward to your informative presentations. Be who you are. It's worked well for you so far. You can count on yourself. Thank you, everyone. Thank you so much.